Hello everyone, and welcome to Power Pages Tips. My name is Nicholas Hayduke, and this is tip number 224. Maps on Forms. In our last tip, we looked at how you can integrate map functionality into lists on Power Pages. In this tip, we'll look at how maps can be added to forms, including multi-step forms, as well. The maps functionality on forms can be used to display an existing location, or you can allow the user to specify a location and have the row in Dataverse updated. The first step is to configure your Bing Maps API key. Like we saw in the last tip, you can get your API key by going to bingmapsportal.com. Once you have it, add a site setting with the name Bing Maps forward slash credentials and the value set to your API key. The next step is to add a section to your model-driven app form where the map will appear. The name of this section should end with section underscore map. So, for example, ec underscore section underscore map, or simply just section underscore map. Also, add the address fields like address line, city, state, country, postal code, and latitude and longitude to your form. The next step is to go to the additional settings tab for basic forms or the additional functionality tab on multi-step form steps and find the geolocation section. Check the enabled and display map checkboxes and map the address fields. With that enabled on your form, you'll see a Bing map displayed. If the form happens to be editable, you can drag the pin around and you'll see the location fields updated on the fly. Note that for basic forms, the map functionality is only enabled when it is displayed in a modal, and not when it is on a standalone page. Thanks for watching, and I hope you found the Power Pages tip number 224 on maps on forms useful.